Welcome back to another Backpage Gaming video. Today we're looking at another starter team. We're one day away from the early access of FIFA 22. You're joining me, Robbie, and we've got Jack with us. Hello, I'm here. I'm just about hyperventilating. I'm very excited for the new FIFA. I think building these starter teams has got us in the mood. Obviously, yes. we've had some time off. I've had a week off work, grinding on some graphics. Yeah. We're ready to go. RTG starts soon. Robbie's bloody rich man's road to pack to power and everything whatever he's doing yeah. he's ready to go as well yeah it's Robbie, tantalizingly close now isn't it get us into this team all right where do you want to start, start with the start with the keeper it's not a, a man that it's like, uh it goes in every team it looks like center backs it is stecklenburg no, absolute guy. classic he's been everywhere hasn't he yeah bit of a journeyman uh if you've known fifa for a while you know that you had an exceptional card in the uh in FIFA 12, he had an 85 rated card. He did, yes. He was phenomenal. Bit of a fall from glory, bless him, but that is He's been around almost a while, 10 years he? ago. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I think you can, you know, thank you for his service. Well yeah. done, Mr. Martin. Thank you. Yeah. Now, Rob. Yes. There's been a lot of hype in the community. There's been a lot of Team of the Week predictions. Yeah. And I see an Eredivisie man from Ajax, from from Deutschland, that's not German. Deutschland. I mean, Deutschland. <laughs> The Dutch land, the land of the Dutch. Um, yeah. I'm guessing it's Mr. Timber at that it left centre back. I'm going down and I'm yelling Timber. I'm not going down on Timber. I'm not not like that. But oh my, yeah, it's Timber. He looks good, very good. He's got 83 pace, 75 dribbling as well, which is high for a centre back, particularly 75 rated one. But he looks phenomenal, doesn't he? If he gets an inform first week, it could be game over. That's the type, you know, like that that type of card. If you pack that. Yes. In, like untradeable something. You're buzzing. Like, I, yeah. know been, I, I think everyone dreams of packing a really good untradeable. Yeah. But it never seems to happen for us, Rob. I don't know why that. Well, was, I mean, you did get Mbappe at the start of last year. I bad. did, yes. That's true. Hopefully, on the RTG, we'll have just as good luck. Yeah. I'm hoping for maybe uh, Ronaldo because heading. Little swirl look, guys. Heading it's looks back. to be back. Yeah. It was in the beta yeah, as well. Not that I will mm. say much about the beta, but. It was uh, it was prevalent, I'll say. Yeah, well, I mean the the game's out to some extent now. There's All the big popular have men have got it. Yeah. Yeah. Unfortunately, yeah, we're not quite was. there yet. Maybe next year. Maybe next year. Where's the has? Anyway, yeah. Rob, take us through. Uh, I'm gonna guess it's a teammate of Timber down at left back. Maybe yes. sounds like some sort of uh, pasta. <laughs> like Tagliatelli. It's in fact yes. Tagliafico. <laughs> hey! Oh my God! It's coming centrally, honestly. Yeah, <laughs> uh, he's an alright card, isn't he? He's solid. He's, for, he's right. not going to last long, but for starter teams, he will do a job definitely. Um, he's got good defending and physical, which is he's got somewhat rare for like a starter left back. Too. Yeah, very good. Yeah, uh, maybe his pace might let you down a little bit, but I don't think he, he's too slow that you, he's unusable. Yeah. I think he'll do a job for you. At the minute, the game looks pretty slow anyway, so I yeah. think kind of like eighty pace, you'll be yeah. you'll be really happy with that. Whether you know. Yeah, if definitely. Yeah. Slow or not, it's going to take a while for people to adjust as well. Yeah, from having like ninety ninety, like nine, like one nine eights all the time. Yeah, yeah. And every player having ninety plus. I'm excited everything. for it, honestly. I think you know when FIFA starts to get a bit outrageous, that's when it dies off for me. When everyone's for me, it's teams. fun for a little bit. Yeah, but then it's like it gets a bit I'm tedious. Just, like, I'm bored this. Yeah, yeah, I'm I'm done. Ah. Um, now because I am a FIFA genius. I've already guessed three players, Rob. Okay. Who is it? Graven Birch. I'm gonna guess because uh, I can't think of any other men that it would be. Um, there he is. Yep, yeah, Graven Birch. Boadu, a man that featured in my league on Saturday. It is Boadu. It. Yes. Click up here, um, and then right away I'm gonna guess Gelson or Diata, one or two. It is Gelson. Yeah, five star skiller. Look. Amazing. He's always a starter team beast, isn't he, Gelson? Yeah. I think he's just one of those cars that he just... He never seems to go away, but he never seems to improve. Like, he just... He's, he's just always like, there, isn't he? Yeah. Yeah, he's just a constant uh, yeah. little average player, bless him. That's why yeah. there's nothing wrong with that. I'd, you know, I wouldn't mind swapping shoes with him for, for a yeah. day or two. Um, the rest of the team... I mean, he's going to be... Sort of, it's obviously a Dutch man um, at centre-back. Yes. It could be an error of easy man. No, it could be. I don't know. Maybe it is. <laughs> what do I know? <laughs> I'm going to say 
Eredivisie man, actually. Yeah, you're probably right. Different nationality. Any idea? No. It's Dutch. It's Nathan Ake. Oh, you, you pranked me. You. <laughs> you tricked me, you little trickster, you. Yeah, looks like a solid card, in all honesty. Yeah, I think Ake is always kind of like a decent start. I remember, actually, fun fact, last year um, I traded with him a lot at the start, and he was really good for me. Oh, okay. So, you, you know, got the hair yeah. trait as well. Yeah, it's always a big thing. Looks a bit yeah. like Hullet in games, so yeah. you can't argue. Right back, it's obviously going to be... I say obviously. I don't actually. I'm, I'm completely thrown here because um, I see that strong link to Gelson from the centre mid. So yeah, I. I've got no clue. No, I've give up. Who is? It? Take me to the right it's back. Nelson Semedo. Okay, Nelson Semedo. So it's a it's a Portuguese mate. Oh, it's Renato. It is Renato. Now this oh, is a, there's a big caveat yeah. with this because he could be a little bit expensive, but I'm not too sure. He looks insane for an 80 rated card. Yeah. He's. I think he's going to be one of them. He'll be cheap. Early access when the game comes out, I think he'll balloon a bit in price and then sort like of slowly 30. drift off. Maybe more. I don't know to be honest. I, he's only eighty rated, so it will be packed a lot. That's what I'm thinking. The thing is, we haven't got those division rival placement games. Exactly. Bonus yeah. Point thingies. Which should this might year, keep so. everyone a bit cheaper. I don't know. We'll have to wait and see. It's going to yeah. be an interesting market this year. I'm really unsure as to how it's yeah. going to pan out at the start. I think everyone's a bit unsure to be honest, especially yeah, with the definitely. change of rewards and schedules. there's. Um, Preview packs as well now. Yeah, of course. Yeah. yeah. Bates and got an icon in his today. He got Baggio, didn't he? Yeah. Yeah, pretty mad. mad. Yeah, he's, gonna he's gonna on say. the red list. Yeah. I can't help but notice that he happens to get gifted the game. You know, every, all eyes are on him. Yeah. Not that I'm stirring the pot, you know. I yeah. don't believe that EA would ever do something so well, No, of course so not. They're, they're always reliable, aren't they? <laughs> Left wing and centre, obviously, this is a, it's a perfect link. It is. But I don't know don't have a clue who it could be, to be honest. Looks like a very, very good duo to start the game. Yeah. It's Diaz. Okay. And Uribe. Look at oh, those two. Jeez. Yes. That, even Uribe, Uribe? Uribe. He looks really good. Yeah, For non-rare as well. Very, very solid, yeah. Even, yeah. I can't. I'm trying to think. There's a non-rare that, remind, that he reminds me of, but I can't quite think of him. Um, That Diaz, he was pretty good. Yeah. This year as well. I feel like he's had a decent card the last couple of years. Yeah. To be honest. He's rumoured to be in Team of the Week as well. So that'll be exciting. Damn, I'm excited for this. I am I really want to get my hands on Renato. I think... He's going to, yeah. He, if you, if he you looks get insane. your hands on one card, um, which is usually what I'd recommend, that you know will just balloon in price, Yeah. get a card that will go in pro teams, potentially at the start. Yeah. 100%. Uh, Renato is very linkable as well. that kind of like stopgap midfielder yeah. until they get to some of the icons or some of the higher rated players because they don't go for the midfielders straight away they go for the attackers, the attackers so. yeah Renato will be definitely very popular and then it's a great that that right side is wonderful I know Nelson Tomatoes lost a little bit of he's pace. lost a bit of pace had to yeah but he looks still good I think yeah definitely yeah I think he'll still do a do a job for the boys yeah 100% yeah I'm impressed Rob I think it's a very solid team I it think is a very nice team yeah we're going to have to... Fun little fact. So far, I was watching Boras. I've been watching bloody everyone. I've gone mad for the uh, FIFA 22. He's got all the screens up. <laughs> yeah, literally every single monitor. You know, different streamer. Yeah. Um, he thinks at the minute, and I kind of agree, that 4-4-2 or 4-1-2-1-2 or 4 triple two, anything with two strikers... Really? ...is needed. Okay, yeah. Yeah, because the passing's a bit slow. Having that ping-pong passing between your two strikers... Yeah. ...looked to be... In, from what I've watched, anyway, from what I saw... It did look really, really good yeah. compared to say you know, like the four-two-three-one he played in draft, and it just looked pointless. So yeah. So with this, you could play like a four-one-two-one-two with like Gelson at Cam and these two up front. Yeah, definitely. That's what I was. That's what I was thinking. Yeah. That's what I was looking at. That's what my eyes were drawn to, Robbie. I'm I'm impressed with the team. It's, it's yeah. really solid. Thank you. I think to be honest with you, even if you didn't get Renato in, um, I'm sure there's somebody else. I'm sure you could just get someone else. Yeah. Because Gelson's happy with chemistry anyway. You could probably get another. I'm sure there's an Eredivisie Eredivi boss man, or yeah. there's actually that um, that I can't remember his name. He's new on the game. He's Brazilian. He's from Marseille. Oh, um, Gerson. Yeah. Yeah, I um, looked at him as well. He looks very you solid. You could slap him in, and then like a right back from um, Marseille, from Marseille or something, yeah. something like that. Yeah, definitely. That looks like a really solid team, either way. Thank I you. Yeah. You're onto a winner, Rob. Yeah, I might build it when the game comes out. If you want to see uh, like a follow-up, if I build the team, then let me know. 
Um, please, guys, make sure to sub. We yes. have got some of the most exciting videos coming to the channel. Obviously, we've we've kind of slacked off a bit with yeah. FIFA being in downtime, but we are ready to get We're ready to smash it, uploads. Yeah. We're at RTG time. I'm excited. Yeah, I'm got shaking. Any ideas for the RTG? Let us know down below. Yeah. If you, if you enjoyed that, hit the subscribe button, as I've already said. Hit the like button. Uh, follow us on Twitter and TikTok. Hopefully, we're going to be yeah, smashing those as well yeah. as, uh, as the game starts coming out. So, yeah, if you've uh, if you've enjoyed it, we'll, uh, we'll see you in the next one. See ya.